folks, how's it going? Welcome to another episode of Walk and Talk q and I guess this is the sixth episode. Today I want to talk about my new book, uh, which I um, published recently, called The Art of Being Remarkable. How to get unstuck, unfucked, and unleash your life, or your potential, sorry. So what is the t- why did I actually write the book? Um... I wrote the book because um, a lot of the stuff out there about finding a passion, about how you can really unleash your potential, is uh, to me seems sort of um, contradicting. So one person might say this, the other person might say that, and uh, you're even more confused than you were ever before. So that's why I decided to to pretty much write this book. But uh, so why why do I think or why do I believe that? I'm the right person to write a book about something like that and I guess the reason is pretty simple because I'm honest uh, and uh, it pretty much started everything started in the summer of uh, 2013 when I decided to quit my job because I had the exact same problem like maybe you might have or a lot of other people have um, that they feel sort of stuck I felt super stuck at my job um, and I more specifically I felt that I had a lot more potential then uh, I was actually being able to show at my job and I realized or I asked myself the question so if your boss is not able to unleash your potential if um, the, the company is not able to unleash your potential who might be the one person to be able to unleash your potential and I thought the only person that might really be able to do this um, is sitting right here is, is actually the person who's talking to you right now. I realized uh, that the only person that might be able to unleash my potential is, is me, right? And uh, so I gave my time myself for, for, for a few years to really figure out what I want to do in life, where I want to be going, and uh, whether or not I actually have this potential that I thought I have. Because maybe it turns out that I don't have any potential at all. That um, uh, I just... Uh, believe that I might have some potential but I don't so I set out two years ago to to find my passion to really figure out what I want in life and what's really possible and uh, ever since I did all sorts of stuff um, I pretty much became a public speaker I speak at all sorts of events about all sorts of things entrepreneurship failure sometimes even success um, which is funny because I don't really I don't really feel that I did anything remarkable in my life yet and uh, I also started all, all sorts of micro businesses because um, everything was the fact that I, I still wanted to figure out whether or not I had the potential that I thought that I had and uh, I learned a hell lot of things during those past two years and at one point I decided to write all these things down there's nothing like no secret sauce or nothing overly um, super smart or anything it's just me sharing my experiences the stuff that I learned the stuff that I learned while experimenting quite a lot the stuff that I learned having read a lot of books from other people and the stuff that I'm talking about in the book um, it might help you or it might not but at the end of the day what it really boils down what being remarkable really boils down is being yourself right it's about being yourself no matter what and not being afraid to show it just like this right now right here um, it's not about being perfect, right? Having like a, a super perfect video, having a super nice cover. It's about being yourself, about being authentic. And that's what I realized, the bottom line, is that if you're authentic, if you're not trying to be somebody else, that's the first step to take to being remarkable or to becoming remarkable. And if you want to know more, uh, how to get, uh, become remarkable, how do you find your passion and ultimately start loving your life, I recommend that you check out my new book, The Art of Being Remarkable. You can find it on my website. It's uh, My website is y-a-n-n-g-i-r-a-r-d.com. So just check it out. Let me know what you think about it. And right now, it's pay as much as you can afford. So I might change that price in the future or might not. So if you want to grab a copy, feel free leave some comments below the video once you read it and I'm sorry um, if I was uh, 
sniffing all the time a little bit, but I got the hay fever um, pretty badly. <laughs> all right, folks, that's it. See you next time. Bye-bye.